Kimono, Kimono, I, I used to call him Kimono, you know, he'll call me Bright One Name. Uh, it was a rude shock. But um, we are all musicians. What matters in life is um, what you were able to do while you were alive. Great artist, played a particular reggae that is very, very distinct and unique. And his lyrics, very, very powerful. Emancipation of Nigeria, emancipation of Africa. We were neighbors, no more less late. That was, you know, where we got close. And we took part in a lot of shows in this country, both local and international. So, uh, I wish him joyful activity. We, we have cause to glorify your holy name. Amen. Jesus mighty day we pray. Amen. Amen. Please, gentlemen, um, very quickly. Not everybody will go to the point of internment. Only families, please, and we want that to be respected. Only families, please. It's a private burial. Only families, okay? And the family will choose the right of who should go in there. Please, okay? Thank you very much. So, um, so please, can we ask everybody now to move out to the other side, please? Well, greetings. My name is Buchi. A few days before Kimono passed, I was with him. He invited me, as a matter of fact, to a program where he was supposed to play. So we played together at that program. And when he first came out with that very first album, I was opening the stage for him over 35 years ago. And then a few days before he passed, he called me again for us to do the same thing. And then we played on that same stage was a rude shock to me and of course he told me he was traveling to the US and so I expected that by Thursday night he would be at the airport he was at the airport all right but Friday morning he was not in America as expected that was when I heard that something terribly terrible had happened <laughs> Because the wrong people want to enter the world for passing. The lion! Who is pushing my ass? The relationship of over 35 years came to an abrupt end and a man of his word, a man of great discipline, 
a man of great, tremendous discipline, went away to be with the Lord. We're here to give him respect, our last respect. We're here to celebrate a life, like everybody has said, most people have said, not to mourn him, because he understood his vision and he fulfilled it. Goodbye, Kim. Goodbye. Led by the executive chairman. Go, Chief. Don't let the music play. I can hear you say, Go, son. Let the music play. Go, son. Let the music play. Go, son. Let the music play. Yes, All right, keep the procession moving. Thank you. Thank you. no road here, please, for back. Start normal procession now.
I did mention before, this thing is turn by turn. Nobody knows it's turn. <laughs> so we should be happy that um, uh, even though we are sad, but we are happy he left a very powerful legacy. He did good music. He did good music. And uh, his music touched souls. I think that is that. I kill him without fail. Rashkimono now from Delta State, and the government of this state said they love their son, and anywhere, dead or alive, they deal with him. So we get people where they, the government send come to, they will go appreciate them, we go recognize and make an airport clap for them. First of all, I'm going to clap for our governor, Dr. Ifai Okowa, I'm going to clap for him, I beg. And the governor not there yet to do, but he don't support. And we get representative of the governor will come today. I been gonna put an hands together for Honorable E. Ilolo. Now they represent our governor today. I'm gonna clap for him. Uh, today is a mixed feeling. We've just mourned, we've just buried him, and uh, uh, we are gathered here so that uh, we can give a good reception to our guests because uh, we have guests from all walks of life. And uh, we appreciate everyone that have come to mourn with us. And we pray that as they go back to their general destination, that God will guide them and uh, grant them safe journey and success in all their endeavor in life. Don't be surprised. That is my salary, brother. Humility, you know, like you know, everybody is restless right now. You know, nobody is happy about his departure. So, all right. Thank you.
Yes, I agree. This is okay. Come on Ladies now. And, and I was just asked finish. what are the things I will miss about my father. Okay. When you ask me what other things, me would I say everything, everything, from his humility to his selflessness, you know, to him being a confidant, to him being an advisor, everything. My partner in crime, my best friend, you know, everything. He's everything, you know. And um, it's sad that he has left us, but I know he lives on in our hearts, and we can hear his voice Ladies through his music. So I preach all of you. I choose to be happy. Bless. Nobody can fill up his shoes, you know, but the legacy that he has built, that is what we're going to work on, you know, and make sure that the kimono name never dies, you know, and that his music is heard across the world. If your father was here, you're going to do something like this. short of words to say things about Raski Mono. But one thing I can say is that may he so rest in peace. He was a legend. Now he's gone. But you know his spirit lives on. His legacy is forever. You know what I'm saying? My name is Harry B and I'm a very good friend. He, he was my mentor. We've been good friends for a long time since I came back to Nigeria. And that's why I told Chadi Shoki that I'm going to be here live regardless. So I'm here, and it's all good. May you still rest in peace. That's all I can say. Good. Ross King Mono, Father, 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 Father. A lot of people raise up their hand.
For more entertaining video content such as behind the scenes of music videos and movies, music concerts, premieres, interviews and exclusive gists, subscribe now to our YouTube channel Goldmine TV and be unleashed into a world of super excitement.